still there. Hey everyone, welcome to the Hump Day Show. I'm Jerks, and uh, today we're actually here talking with gaming Dan? Dan Gaming? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Hello? No, I'm just kidding, man. I'm, I'm here with Gaming Dan. Uh, it's this strange person that I found on the internet. Ooh. Ooh. But it Ooh. turns out he actually lives uh, pretty close, like down the street. No, I'm just kidding. He lives in San Antonio, a whole different city. But uh, gaming, introduce yourself. Say what's up. <laughs> oh, nothing much. Just uh, chilling. Oh, okay, oh, all God. right. Now we have a deep voice. Hey guys, what's up, everybody? <laughs> <I can't. laughs> no, 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 no. You're, gonna, you're not gonna get away with that. Huh? All, right, all right, come on. Go. Home. <laughs> <laughs> you know, just uh, mm-hmm. chilling, and grilling, ma- make, making them vids on YouTube and uh, live streaming. You know, uh, right. you know. Just, 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 just a little bit of something, something you know, you know. <laughs> no, but uh, him and I, we've been talking about, uh, you know, we've been talking about doing some stuff together, especially like podcasting format and whatnot, and streaming. And well, one of the things he actually uh, brought up to me was this whole "quote unquote" controversy. I believe. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. I, I want uh, seriously, dude. Like, I like. I know this is serious, but. Ever since I saw the video with your mom on it, I like, I like, I can't, I can't with this guy. It's too, it's real, but it's like, oh my god. But anyways, no, I just wanted to bring him on as well and like, pretty much bring and discuss what it's been going on with him, with, with the developers from a certain video game. I don't know if you want to name the game or talk about it, or I don't know what you're allowed to say about what not. I don't know. You know what I mean? I mean, at this point, it doesn't really matter to be honest. You know. Okay, so we're talking about what are we talking about the original Red Dead, right? The first yeah. one? Yeah. Well first one. Well not not the very, very first one, but the one that came out on PS three, I believe. Red Dead Redemption. Yeah. Right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. All right. And we're talking about some uh, you do modifications on there, some mods for the cool kids. And well apparently Rockstar and uh their parent company are not too happy about that. And pretty much, yeah, no, I'm gonna let you take it from there to get, let's just let us know like what happened from the beginning to where you are now. <sighs> well, 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 where do we begin on that? So, uh, <laughs> I'd say I spent like at least two years mm-hmm. or a little bit more now, you know, um, right after, well, no, actually, no. Uh, during and after the uh, one of my first projects that we got cease and desist order from Take Two, mm-hmm. uh, that one was porting the Red Dead One map to uh, GTA Five. So that that was one of the uh, first uh, confrontations that I had with them. I was I was uh, one of the um, people who are handling the Mm -hmm. uh, map and other things and whatnot with the uh, porting and whatnot. And um, yeah, so they, um, we had teased it uh, and then we, and as soon as we uh, released like a uh, trailer tour uh, towards it and basically uh, we had uh, in a working state, um, lots of stuff and we teased it. And then, like, I guess, like, I don't know, maybe, maybe a couple weeks, mm-hmm. like, maybe like one or two weeks, uh, they had contacted uh, contacted us. Um, then they had told us that basically um, we had to cease and desist. So, yeah. So I, I during that time, I was researching, uh, doing uh, things and here and there mm-hmm. um, to to contribute. And uh, um, after that. I had quit uh, doing GTA 5 modding in particular for during that long period of time until like like now 
And uh, 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 and you said there is a team of you guys. There's like more. Uh, I thought I wasn't the person. It was just you. <laughs> well, in this particular project, it's just oh, me. Okay, 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 okay. So uh, I mean, again, like, I mean, honestly, when when he t- first told me about this stuff, I was like, what? Like, I knew about modding, obviously. I mean, if anybody's ever heard of it, like. Uh, Skyrim type of game, Fallout type of game. I mean, obviously, if you know about modding, like we've heard of it, and like, but I was like, okay, I know of it, but I don't know what the hell it entails. So I actually did a little bit of research, but e- even the research didn't come out <laughs> that great. I was like, uh, I'm gonna ask him what he does. But I mean, for for doing this stuff, like for you, it is it like, for example, is this something you do? For the fun of it, for the money of it, if there's any income, for for any X reason. Like, what is it the reason that you do this? And then w- what are you doing towards, like, what what are you doing that's making you feel like, hey, you know, 2K should probably, like, I mean, Take-Two should probably just back off. Well, <clears throat> I mean... I mean, I guess you could say a mixture of everything, but okay. majority, okay. but majority, uh, but I can't even say it. majority. Uh, <laughs> I want to say that uh, I just want to do it just because, you know, I I think that, you know, just why not? Well, I mean, I, I, I have rights to do it. I could do it. Mm-hmm. And if, if I get something in, in return and people want to, and it's an optional thing and there's no paywall, right. then, you know, there you go. Um, um so with take two um even though there's absolutely nothing that's actually like legally they they could do on Mm -hmm. there Mm -hmm. um and since it is single player and they say multiple times as long as it doesn't mess with multiplayer no matter what they said you know you can't do it and i i think Personally, what what it's come down to recently mm-hmm. uh, with these new lawyers and whatnot, uh, basically that they, they just don't want to allow it to happen because it's not out on PC, and since they uh, abandoned porting that particular um, version of the game to to PC, right? Um, they I guess they still have some sort of uh, contract with Microsoft and Sony. But I don't really think that's really much of anything. Um, if anything, I think that my project is the one that actually got Red Dead Redemption 2 on PC, to be, to be honest. Um, so, I mean, I guess there's something that came out good out of it. However, it's not going to stop me from, like, modding in particular. However, uh, <clears throat> when my recently talking to my lawyer he had advised me to just possibly like skipping over uh this particular project and just going straight to uh red dead 2 mm-hmm. this is on pc mm-hmm. um and they've been shouting their mouth saying oh we're gonna have mod support we're gonna allow you to do this and that you can do single player be like what, whatever you know mm-hmm. we'll, we'll just do that so i i think uh I think that's the best option for now. I'm right. still gonna try to uh, do the best I can to see we get what we could do. Um, and are you working on something for Red Dead Redemption Two? Uh huh. I I I'm that's what I'm doing right now is um, doing a couple things here and there. And but um, is it anything that's ready to go? Or is it still under development? It's still in development. It's it's very very early, and right. you know it's. But, but the thing is, is that um for for the project itself, um, I I think that it's it's a much better, safer thing. Right. Um, my lawyer had did some research on these lawyers, so basically that they're like cutthroat. They're like the ones that you would use in a mafia, or right. or in the rap game, or or you know like basically if you're if you're like the top. Uh, top tier echelon who who has the money, you know, and oh, fame sure and whatnot has the money. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> that's they will literally put a a guy that does nothing in prison. They they could just do that, you know. Yeah. They could shuffle the money and, and uh, just be like, okay, yeah, yeah, we got you. 
We got you, homie. Yeah, but, that, was, um, that was gonna be my other thing. I was like, well, from your point of view, you're saying that there is there isn't anything illegal that you're doing. Nothing against their like, I guess their terms of services for their video games that you're doing against that. I was gonna say, why not just push and just do it regardless? Release your content, your mods, regardless. But yeah, now that you're saying that, I'm like, <laughs> does he really want to go to jail though? <laughs> like, does he? Do, I mean, you know? realistically, I I would win. Right. But it's it's the money aspect, and since mm. unfortunately, like I mean, I, I I never expected it, but um, looking at my, I mean, I didn't, never made any revenue at all on my YouTube videos, um, and that's a long story with YouTube, um, how they're treating uh, content creators and whatnot, but mm -hmm. um, but that's a whole different uh thing. Uh, I had my my partnership stripped. I I wasn't able to monetize the videos at all. So um and then all my other like options to donate and in Patreon and whatnot. Um unfortunately there has there hasn't been any anything. So if I were wanting to push for that, I can't do it. There's no money. <laughs> like mm -hmm. uh if I had if, if even just you know whatever, I would and I do not want to open up a uh, GoFundMe. Mm -hmm. Um I mean, it's an option, but I don't really think I, because at that point, you know, I, I don't want to like feel like I, I'm obligated to, you know, at that point, you, you don't really know exactly if you, if you can actually push to win it. You can't, you know, I don't, I don't want to let down people and then be like, well, we gave you money, but you know, blah, 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 but it doesn't work like that. You don't, you, just because you give the money doesn't guarantee that's going to uh win anything so oh yeah yeah no if anything yeah. we've seen that with shenmue 3 <laughs> yeah like that game came out and it's just like uh you know a little bit like what is it like 10 20 years whatever how long it's been since the original two came out yeah yeah and that was what uh not it was a gofundme it wasn't another one i forgot it's one of those like crowdfunding ones indiegogo i think was it an maybe go okay yeah no nah, man but um Okay, well then, uh, what are you doing now? Like, okay, now that you're in this whole situation, you said you're working on the on the next one. Um, are you gonna if something like this happens again with Take Two? Are you still gonna continue? Are you gonna have to roll until the next one? I mean, what are you gonna do? That I don't really think they're gonna they they can't really do that because they already had voiced their opinions on mods for this particular thing. So mm -hmm. if they did, then again there will be false advertisement they can't they can't go back on their words you know mm -hmm. so if they try something they'll be like well you know you can't you can't erase everything you said on air. everybody has a you know archived i mean you you, you just can't stop the project from happening mm -hmm. and I, i'm just gonna spend uh the next couple weeks here of this month mm -hmm. try to work it out i believe that they were they offered um like i can't remember how much it was like two or five 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 k to to have a texas uh lawyer and they were willing to pay for for me for consultation mm -hmm. and whatnot but <clears throat> when i'm gonna have when i you know it may sound crazy and i think this is the best option mm -hmm. you know it's it's not it's not because of the money i think you know what i could do is probably talk to me and say hey um you know, I don't want to upset anybody for all this, but I think that the two years I spent on there, I think they should just give that to me, and then I can reinvest that into doing much bigger things with the channel, mm -hmm. and you know, and putting that towards you know, whatever. Mm -hmm. And if that's that's acceptable, I mean, already uh, Take Two already had, you know, this is this is. Um, um uh, their budget and they're willing to spend mm -hmm. and if they're willing to spend that I, I don't really see that being much of a big deal i mean it's 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 a slap in the face to throw away you know endless you know like hours and nights and whatever you know i think that seems a little bit fair mm -hmm. you know and i think that's just you know it's not going to go towards like poker or whatnot you know, it's, it's just going to go actually towards my channel so i can actually further and whatnot right right right. and but yeah i, I don't i mean I, there's a lot of people 
judge me for what I have and what not. But I mean, if you look the rest of my life, it's not like that. You know, it's a very small percentage. Mm -hmm. And obviously, when you're wanting to do a, you know, be a YouTube creator and, um, you know, live stream and whatnot, of course, you, you need to invest money into right, the course. stuff you, you just you just can't you just it's it's impossible to do with what you got you ha you have to go a little bit beyond that to make sure that things work as the way you want it to and, and no no just, yeah i get you yeah. no all right man well that's it for uh, the hump day show I, 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 I want just really quick i'm sorry i don't mean to cut it off but we're actually going to continue talking a little bit we're going to be doing a little bit on the uh, on our main podcast uh so catch that if you're catching this, this is on Wednesday, so go back to the other video. <laughs> but all right, guys, thank you so much. Thank you again, uh, Eamon Damned. Uh, anything else you want to say to take two? Go ahead, man. Just unload. Let them know. Just, uh, Just let them know. If you guys are watching this, uh, <laughs> eventually I'm going to I'm gonna have to, to make a, an update video. But yeah, just do know that I know you're watching everything that I've, I appear on and whatnot. And... <laughs> um especially that well uh, one rogue guy that's going out and making videos on me as well you know oh you have a rogue guy making videos on you yeah some dude called rogue but oh shit all right we gotta talk about that in a little bit <laughs> <laughs> all right man well thank you again man i really do appreciate this and uh thank you everybody for watching uh again we're on uh we're on all social media platforms we're on twitter uh instagram facebook uh Twitch, we have a Twitch channel. We just pretty did. Uh, the Three Way Podcast, of course, main podcast is on Spotify, Anchor, uh, Apple Podcasts, all those streaming, uh, all the platforms for podcasting, and of course the main, the main YouTube channel, the Three Way Podcast. All right, uh, you guys can go also go check out Gaming Dam's YouTube channel and he streams Twitch.tv/slash Gaming Dam. All in the description below. All right, guys, see you. <laughs> <laughs>